back. Hi, what's up, everybody? Josh is here, and today, if you guys remember, I haven't been on this YouTube channel in ages. You guys are probably wondering where have I been. Me and King Collector, formerly known as King Collector, King Stop Motion. I'm formerly known as Josh from Sports Media. You guys could go check that out. It's a popping right on the screen right now. Click that. That's my YouTube channel, guys. And it's been a long time since I posted anything. The weather's been getting a little bit warmer here in New York. So I haven't got a chance to go fishing. And uh, guys, I have a fish tank. I have a new lizard. It's just everything. And today, I thought of this very great, cool idea that I saw off of YouTube. And it says, the world's smallest aquarium. So I said it would be too small to wait to keep a fish in there. So I said maybe, just maybe, I should just keep a shrimp. A shrimp. It's just gonna be a testing thing, don't laugh. Well, I'm gonna put two fish, maybe they might have eggs or something like that. And I don't know, it's just gonna be an experiment, guys. And it's gonna be really cool just to find out. I'm gonna get like a little bowl, and we are buying all this stuff from the Dollar Store. It's called Dollar Tree, I think everyone knows what that is. If you live over here in that neighborhood, and let's get right on to it. I don't want to record it so everyone else will be staring at us. And here we go. We're going in. We're going to look where we can put the shrimp. I went all the way in the back, and I couldn't go from the other side. This is where the pet stuff is. So, yeah, there's only for, like, dogs, cats, animals like those, hamsters. Hey, take wait, hold on. Let's look. Come here. Now this is to, I need something that I can put a fish tank in, maybe they're, yeah, balls, okay, that's what we need, and look at that, oh wow, there's so many balls, there is literally so many balls, wow, and uh, yeah, this is all a dollar, guys, so I don't even have to ask how much everything is, ooh, and here's another ball, this is for a better, this is for a better, um, um, no, I have actually gravel at home, so that's going to be perfect. I want something maybe a little plasticky. Well, by mine, I'll just get that if anything, but, um, something small, 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 small. And it's kind of packed over there. Let's make a right. Maybe sign by the containers. So that's a good base. That's a good work for right now, but I'm trying to find something even smaller. And anything, just a bunch of cups right over here. Container maybe with a top on it. Wait, wait. Ah, uh, no, this, yeah, it's too much of a cup like. I don't think I would put a shrimp in there. Um, I need something with a cover, guys. Uh, okay, worst comes to worst, I'm just gonna get the other one. Um, what? Does it not look like. I'm just gonna take one last scan through the this aisle. Did we go on this aisle? Yeah. Oh wait, we didn't look on this side. So let's just look on this side. No, that's just for laundry. Take plastic. Come on, it's something plasticky. And um. Why not? That's a, that's a nice better ball shape. Maybe I could pick that in. Let's see. Okay, so we finally got on this aisle, and I'm debating between one and two. Both are, I think this is plastic. Hold on. No, glass, and let's see this. Glass as well. So what do you think I should get? Um, huh, King? I think this one. Uh, it has more room in it. Yeah, I could make a top for that one and this one. Well, this one, yeah, it's more for the shrimp. I don't want to, like, suffocate the guy. Well, this is the world's smallest aquarium. So, maybe I'll just put it as the cheapest aquarium to make, you know, in case you're, like, bored and you have nothing else to do with your money. In that case, it's us. And, uh, yeah, just hold that. Okay, now we need something like a decoration, a decoy. Um, let's look. Figures, 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 toys, toys. You see like a Batman or something like that? Um, um, 
Oh, oh, here. This Wonder Woman. That would, yeah, oh, move. So that would fit perfect, but it's like open, so I'll just put that down right there. Um. No, I'm looking for like Batman. Oh, there? Yes, I'm sorry. Oh, they it's have. Batman. Oh, come on. Iron Man? No, I need like. Yeah. No want for it to stand. The Undertaker? The Undertaker. Wow. The Undertaker. Not bad. I could put the Undertaker. What do you think I should do? I think Undertaker or look for a superhero? I think the Undertaker is looking good. Nothing, nothing. Let's look over here. Come. Uh, supplies, school supplies. And I think, yeah, just the Undertaker. The Undertaker looks pretty dope. Um, hold this. I'm just gonna look. Take one last scan. Where was it? Over here. Let's look over here at the Marvel. Iron oh, Man. Now, this is more like a chess piece rather than something you could put. Well, none of these things are made for that. It's just like made for a little toy that you could just like throw around, beat up, you know. Um, Ursula, Corel de Vil, all these Disney things. Okay, so we're gonna go pay for that. We're gonna go buy the shrimp. I will see you guys in Petco. Two dollars right there, here. Oh wait, wait, no. Yeah, I'm still not giving up on that, okay. Let's go pay. Here we go. And guys, we have just paid. The total was $2.16. It was tax since it's not food. And we are going straight to Petco right now where we will buy just two shrimp. The food I will handle with at home. If they do start having eggs, I will eventually buy a moss ball and some other... <laughs> yeah, yeah, algae basically. I have a lot of like uh, syrup, algae syrup, which will cause more algae. So let's hope they survive. This is the world's cheapest aquarium. This is an experiment. I'm not trying to hurt the pets at all because eventually I will put them in my big 20 gallon large aquarium, 30 inches long, not to mention, because I have already two shrimp in there and I just want to put these two shrimp in a separate one to see if they would survive. Here we go, on to Petco, see you guys there. Did you ever think about what the fish in my shrimp right now is doing in my fish tank? I'm gonna show you guys that. And we are going right in Petland, Petco actually. Petland we tried, it was all poor recording, they didn't let me record. So yeah, and plus they didn't have any shrimp. So we're gonna try Petco. They usually have what, the whisker shrimp or the, the ghost shrimp. shrimp, even the cherry shrimp. And here we go. Look at this video, guys. It's really funny. And guys, I know they do not let people record. I know they have like a history. So I am putting something right over so they don't think I'm recording. So they probably think I'm crazy for talking to my phone. Okay, and we're going right now. Let's go right into the fish stuff. And can you cover for me? Because I don't want them to like see this. And we're going to the fresh waters like a lot of dead fish usually over here. Kind of sad, but true. Amino. Oh, here we go. 50 cents for the ghost shrimp. They have cherry shrimp usually also. I hope they have them. So I'm going to call the nearest person and let's hope they have it. They better have it. In the meantime, uh, it's probably going to take forever for them to come. But uh, in the meantime, I'm just going to look at everything. They better have these shrimp because so far I don't see nothing. Anything, no sense of life whatsoever. They're supposed to have amino shrimp. They don't have any algae. Oh, you hear us? They're looking for aquatics and um, yeah. But mostly, I don't really like to get fish in here. They're usually always sick and under surveillance. So I don't know. Just keep covering, keep on looking back and forth. And I think they're gonna come. So I'll show you guys if they do. 
20 minutes later. For 20 minutes, I'm not even lying to you guys, dead serious. 20 minutes, no freaking shrimp. I am so upset. And uh, we're gonna just go to our next Petco, and that will probably be the last one. So let's hope they have them. Cross our fingers. One in Petco, we must have called at least seven of them about the whole shrimp process. And you know what they said? Sorry, we don't have it. Sorry, we don't have it. Sorry, we don't have the shrimp coming in another day. But I do not want to wait another day. So today, we are going to get whatever's in the next pet I don't care if it's clams. I don't care if it's crabs. I don't care if it's... Give me something else. Snails. I don't care. As long as it has to do with a crustacean family, I'm going to get it. Even a frog. Don't laugh. Because I've been going through a lot lately with this entire... Whole entire shrimp thing. I've been going through a lot this entire day. Must have been an hour at to win. And two pet goes 20 minutes each. That's how ridiculous this is why I can't stand pet stores nowadays. But what do you gotta do? I like privately owned. And um, so we're gonna go in the next pet land. Whatever is there is there. I don't care. No stinking employee is gonna tell me to record or not. Let's go. This is absurd. This really is. Okay, apparently, and here we go again. This is like chronically all over. I just keep on going the same thing. And here we go. We're gonna look at that big thing. And I don't care if they're gonna tell me to stop recording. I will prove this to you. Uh, you guys know I hate going at Petland. Okay, let's see. Here we go. All these dying fish. Sad. Okay, th guys, there was no clam, so I got this little tiny blue mystery snail. I have to go with one for right now. Let's see how this one does. If the other two, don't forget, guys, once they get way bigger, I'm just gonna put them in a bigger tank, so. Yeah. Okay, let's go pay for that. You can record me. Let's see if he's awake. Oh, yes. The Zigmeister is awake, guys. This guy is named Ziggy. He is a boy. And I bought him back in November when the sale was going on. This is his habitat. Do you guys think it's nice? That will be for the next video. But this is right now. For right now, this is Ziggy. Ziggy, this is the people who are watching YouTube. You are a superstar. I change up this place every once, couple of months. And I got his crickets right there. It's feeding time. I'll put that in the next video. Just ate all of his mail and wax worms. And let's go right back to the snail. How are you guys doing? Here is my fish tank. I have a bunch of tetras, mollies, and platies. Neon tetra right over there. A lot of new... Cool stuff I've been picking up. I have a frog and a coolie loach. They're all compatible. And once the frog gets bigger, I'll put them in a 10-gallon tank and I'll buy an extra large one as well. And there you go. You guys can see my whole filtration, my automatic fish feeder, my volcano that lights up. But this will all be for the next video because my snail is just chillaxing right now in the water. Just try and make the temperature perfect. And here we go. And here is the gravel. I have a whole crap full of gravel. And I'm just going to take out one cupful. I think that will be enough.
Wow, he looks so big, and this ball is much heavier. I used one and a half, one and a half of bottles of water. As you could see, this was filled up to the top. Only half is left, and I used the bottle before that. The Undertaker looks huge. The gravel fits nice. I have extra gravel, which is good. And now let's put in the snail. I think it's been more than 20 minutes. Here we go. And guys, wow, what a mission, but the snail is inside. He is not moving so far. Well, he just has to adjust. I put one more because he's going to be in a cold habitat. And um, maybe I'll give him some filtration. Let's see. I don't really think snails need filtration right now. But the tank is looking really good. And guys, this has been the world's cheapest and smallest aquarium for fish. I could actually put a fish in here better, but that would kind of be abuse and for crustaceans and guys i will give you guys updates every day and where the snail is heading and the food process i will do a feeding tonight on all my animals the fish i will show you the feeding on the leopard gecko and the snail and yeah he is moving short uh slowly but shortly he is moving so guys please subscribe like Leave a comment, damn, it feels good to be back. Ari, formerly known as King Collector, he's just over here watching the entire video. Say hi. Hi. And he just said hi. He's just busy playing PS4. Okay, peace out.